So you missed our webinar on making stories personal? Well, don't worry, we're going to recount it for you in just a few minutes. Okay, so one of the first questions we get is why make science stories in particular personal? Well, it can be more engaging to talk about your work, whether that's through teaching or public talks or maybe interviews. And frankly, it's just great for your career. So if nothing else, which I hope that's not the case, it can help you personally and professionally, but it's also just more fun. And stories are personal just by their nature, and people will care about you telling a story, but they'll especially care about you telling a science story, because storytelling, specifically talking about science through stories, can help you forge connections and inspire folks in a way that just throwing a lot of facts at them or giving them a copy of your dissertation or whatever might not do. And there are some really fun ways that you can make stories personal. You can add those really fine details in there. And again, go back to appealing to the senses. If you're talking about something like a disease, like this blight crept over the land, uh, or just your personal experience, you can add this kind of narrative tension, this idea that I want to know what happens next. It's the, the book you can't put down um, or the movie or show that you can't stop watching. And another question we get asked is, okay, well, I'm convinced on why this matters, but can I be the person to tell these stories? Well, yeah, of course you can. Ask yourself, what do you smell, see, hear, touch, whatever it might be? These are things that people are going to cue in on because they can relate to them and they can be in your story and they'll think about it as if it's happening to them as well. That's the power of a really good story. And also, stories just help us connect with people, and again, regardless of whether it's about science or not, but especially with the sciences, because we don't, again, just want to be throwing facts at them. And honestly, any sort of story can be interesting. It's about how you tell it. If you show passion and show that you care about it, other people will care about it. Other people will internalize what you're trying to tell them and trying to get across, and they'll really resonate with it. So... Make sure you follow us on social media for all of your storytelling needs and all of your other science communication needs. We hope to see you at a future webinar.